Welcome to video 5.4b, define various four-sided polygons. So these are all four-sided polygons. You can pause it, write it down. I just want to uh, explain the way that I define them. So I say where they came from and what additional properties they have. So for example, a quadrilateral is a polygon with these special properties, four sides. A parallelogram is a quadrilateral with these extra properties, two pairs of parallel sides. Okay, so when you define these, where you came from and the extra properties. Uh, so you can list these all down. Some things I wanna emphasize, um, I'm putting in some um, parallel markings, some right angle markings, some tick markings. Uh, some students get confused with this for a kite disjoint pairs. So pairs means two things at a time. Disjoint means I've got this pair and this pair. I'm not mixing and matching. For example, I'm not calling this a pair and this a pair. I've double dipped on that side. So I've got a pair there and I got a pair there. And those two disjoint uh, not mixing and matching sides are um, congruent. Uh, square is both a rhombus and a rectangle, just to emphasize that. Uh, trapezoid is very similar to parallelogram, except parallelogram has two pairs of parallel sides. Trapezoid has exactly one, not two. Okay, uh, and then isosceles trapezoid just uh, the uh, it's a trapezoid where the legs are congruent. The legs are the non-parallel sides. And in future videos, we'll talk about the lower base and the upper base, the lower base angles, the upper base angles, things of that. Okay, so pause the video, write these down, and then we'll uh, go over a uh, classification tree in the next video.